एक्स्ट्रा टाइम Hit the subscribe option and the bell icon to get all the exclusive sports videos on extra time. Fourth March 2022 was an important day. Not all important days are really happy days, but then there were things to cheer about. Virat Kohli was playing his hundredth Test match. After 24 years, Australia had gone to Pakistan to play a Test match, and of course, the ICC World Cup, the Women's World Cup. started in new zealand it was the first day but then early on 4th march there was some bad news rodney marsh the australian wicketkeeper had died of a cardiac arrest he was 72 years old it was sad very sad he was one of the legendary figures of australian cricket caught marsh bowl lily had been something that uh, well was a part of folklore as far as australian cricket in the 70s and uh, 80s was concerned there was a certain gentleman a 52 year old man who after rod marsh passed away was very upset and this is what his tweet said he said sad to hear the news that rod marsh has passed away he was a legend of our great game and an inspiration to so many young boys and girls Rod cared deeply about cricket and gave so much especially to Australia and England players sending lots of love to Ross and the family RIP mate little did he know that around 13 hours after that he too would not be here with us yes it was the legendary Shane Warne he passed away at the age of 52 13 hours after Rod Marsh passed away that day and for us it was one of the most saddest incidents that has ever happened in the world of cricket he was watching the first test versus um, australia and pakistan when the incident happened in fact he felt unconscious and then for about uh, 20 minutes there was an attempt to uh, give him cpr in fact cpr was performed on him he had no heartbeat the ambulances came he was in fact in thailand and then he was declared dead very sad shane won the legendary australian leg spinner was no more we of course know about his records and we know what you know how many wickets he's taken and you know what all he's done on the field but then there were certain contributions as far as shane won is concerned that i thought that i'll take up on this video one of them is his contribution to the Rajasthan Royals cricket team after the day that Rod Marsh had passed away Ajay Jadeja scored 175 runs not out Ajay Jadeja was one cricketer who somewhat owed his rise in cricket to uh, the great Shane Warne Shane Warne's manager said that a lot of people thought that maybe he was you know into too many drinks or he was into drugs but then You know he also said that uh, one was uh, certainly dieting quite a bit and uh, he never drank so much and neither was he ever into drugs. Well I'm not going to be getting into you know Shane Warne's uh, figures and you know what a great bowler he was because we all know what a great uh, uh, spin bowler he was. But then there were certain things as far as uh, Shane Warne has done for uh, Indian cricket and one of them was his association with uh, the Rajasthan Royals team. In the year 2008 Shane Warne was associated with Rajasthan Royals and it so happened that a day after Shane Warne died Ravindra Jadeja went on to score 175 runs and I'm sure he would have dedicated that knock to none other than the great Shane Warne because Shane Warne actually showed Ravindra Jadeja when he was part of the Rajasthan Royals team as to what professional cricket was all about Shane Warne really loved Ravi Jadeja He affectionately called him Rockstar and he was the one who actually nurtured him nurtured his career into professional cricket. He was only 19 years at that point of time when uh, Shane Warne was the captain and coach of uh, the Rajasthan Royals team. It is said that initially Shane Warne was not too keen in taking up the Rajasthan Royals captaincy but then a co-owner told him show the world an Australian captain that they have never seen. that is something that really boosted Warne and he took on the captaincy of the Rajasthan Royals and he inspired the team as a leader like none before 
Now that was something that really inspired Shane Vaughan and we know that the rest is history. He converted the team into a winning machine with the main aspect of his leadership being to bring the team as close as possible. Of course, there are many, many more stories to Shane Warne. Shane Warne was perhaps the best captain that never really captained his national side. Rest in peace, legend. Goodbye. This is extra time. Extra time.